Okay, special thanks to Whoopi tonight because wait, <laughs> I've been trying for a while. I'd seen some of the Russian guys with their catches and they've been getting really good film bulbs lit, you know, properly lit, not a ball of plasma like uh, happens whenever I put my bulbs near the near the exciter. And uh, whoop, I, I just turned on YouTube and I saw Whoopi doing basically the same thing but with a small DC bulb and just one loop of steel wire. Um, so I had the stuff here ready to give it a try and yeah, it works great. I, I, let's, let me show you on 12 volts first. That's what Whoopi was using. Now, you've got to make sure you don't touch the wire otherwise, believe me, it really hurts. Now, can you see my bulb down there? It really goes. It's really bright. Lovely and bright. And it, it works best when it's at the bottom of my exciter. But look at that, beautifully bright. Now let's see how it works on the receiver coil, because here's a receiver coil I've got grounded. And it does work. There we go, it's on my receiver. It works halfway up, look at that, beautifully. That's wireless transmission. Um, that's a DC filament bulb. So I was really pleased with that. Now I can show you that it does work much stronger when I put it on 32 volts, but I'm really rather pleased with that anyway. So I'll show you 32 volts very quickly. Hang on. Okay, you can't be playing with, uh, <laughs> with this with the 32 volts. You've got to take things seriously because it really burns. I mean, it's it's a kind of a uh, sh shock which burns. It doesn't just shock you. It's not like the plasma at the top. It it, it burns. Anyway, I'll turn this on. Okay, you can see from the plasma that it's firing up. Now look at this bulb go this time. Look at that. Is that not a beautiful thing to behold? Now we'll look at it on the uh, receiving coil. Of course, this is wireless. And it's always halfway up the receiving coil where it just seems to get good. And then halfway up, beautiful. Look at that, lovely jubbly. So thank you, Whoopi, because I really had been messing about, doing nothing. Nothing was working. Uh, whatever I was playing around with, it just would not work. And then Whoopi said, DC bulb, loop of uh, steel wire, and well, everything started working. Yeah, I really appreciate it. But like I say, it will work nicely on 12 volts, as you've already seen. Do wear gloves, because it really does hurt. <laughs>